It is Sunday. My goodness, seems like all the days run together now. Um, so today we are doing stretches and I'm going to do a little bit of a different stretch routine than what we did last week and the week before. Um, a few of the same stretches, but a couple added in ones. So first we're going to do Cobra. Remember we hold these all for a 10 count. Um, so Cobra is like this and we're going to hold for 10, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. That one really does work stretching out your spine and your abdomen, abs. Really good stretch there for that part. Okay, then we're going to do butterfly. So you're going to do the bottoms of your feet together. So stretching your inner thighs with your hamstrings, your quads, the growing area right here that we use a lot of. So stretching that. Ten, nine, eight. It rained here earlier today and now the sun is coming out so it's really nice. It's going to be warm today so it's a great day to get outside and do some walking. Okay and then we're going to do straddle. Your feet go out. You're reaching for your toes as far as you can go. It's a great one for flexibility. Oh, it kind of might hurt, but feel good at the same time. Ten, nine, eight. Some of those of you that do ballet or gymnastics are a lot more flexible than I am. And this is a, definitely a good one to do. Three, two, one. Okay, and then right hurdle. Oh, there's that train again. So you bring in your left leg. Like this, it should touch the inside of your thigh here. You're gonna reach with both hands, trying to touch your shoelaces or your ankle. One, two, three, four, five. Hope you got some good rest last night. That's good for your body too, so that you're ready for the new day. Okay, and then left hurdle, in this way. It's good to do these stretches too when you get up in the morning, get your body, that blood flowing. We do those workouts all week long. A little something different on your Sunday morning. Okay, and then toe touch. Your feet go together. You're keeping your knees straight, not bending them, keeping them straight and reaching for your toes. Did a little self-care yesterday. I got all dressed nice to just walk to the kitchen and to the living room. That was fun. Okay, and we're going to do the right quad. This is my right leg, so. So you're holding your hips straight and pushing that leg out and you keep your knees close together when you do this you can hold on to something because you are at home that's a good idea if you need your balance and then switch Ooh, that breeze feels good oh it's such a beautiful day the sun is coming up i can see it coming through the trees okay and then i'm gonna do right leg one because I like this one, especially with all the running I do. So you're going to push the back leg back. This is my left leg back. And really drive that heel to the ground that's stretching out your calf. And then if you lean a little forward and keep this leg straight, you can stretch out your hamstrings back here. It's a great stretch. switch. I'm going to push that heel back. Keep this leg straight. Nice job. Five, four, three, two, one. Okay, and then our right shoulder stretch. Put your right arm back. Remember, your left arm goes up and you're trying to reach. Hands together. So this is one that we all do for public schools for our present our um, fitness test every year. Okay, and then switch. Left shoulder stretch. Open 
lift up your back and your chest, stretching those shoulders, deltoids, and biceps and triceps. All right, um, we haven't done these in a while, so we're gonna do these, a little bit of cardio here, just a little bit. We're gonna spell out teamwork with our jumping jacks. So um, we'll do the whole word, and then we'll say teamwork makes the dream work at the very end. So here we go. T E A M W O R K. Teamwork makes the dream work. Okay. Um, I have to say thanks to my daughters. They um, video this every morning. They take turns getting up. So for teenagers, it's kind of an interesting thing getting them up in the morning. So I appreciate both of my daughters for doing that for me every morning. Um, have a wonderful day. It's going to be a beautiful day here in Texas. I have seen some places are getting snow. Yikes. But you know, I guess that's kind of how it goes anywhere, depending on where you live. Um, but I know that you can always find something to be grateful for throughout your day. So much love and joy and happiness to you this day. Find something to be grateful for. Do something for yourself to love on you so that you can take care of yourself through this time. Drink lots of water, um, eat healthy, and um, send in your exercises that you'd like us to do. We'll get started back tomorrow on our exercises. Coach Bowman loves you all. Bye. Have a great day.